Hello, good afternoon, Steve here. Hope you're all well. Um, VCLT time. Um, got a package of Holzburg metal from Spain. Uh, we all know Rennie needs no introduction. Um, watching his channel is a delight, and it's also an education as well. Um, he's put me on to more new bands than probably anybody else in the VCL uh, VC. Um, if you look at some of the stuff he's hold up, holding up, I've never heard of it. And when he comes to play it, um, it just blows your mind. It's so good. And it's just a great, great channel. Plus, I'm jealous of the guy because he lives in a warm country. And uh, on my Facebook feed, or I see his pictures uh, in the uh, on the beach. And, and I'm sat here, and it's rain, it's grey weather. It's a bit like my cousins in South Africa on Christmas Day and you're there freezing with your blankets wrapped round you and it's really grey and they're in the swimming pools and they're saying why aren't you here but uh, I, I shan't hold the envelope up but that's it, that's it anyway I should give you a quick tip, that's it but I don't want to show any addresses but I have pre-opened it anyway look um, but you have to forgive the lateness of this film I did receive it yesterday um, they fixed the central heating, but I tried to record it this morning with we banging pipes because apparently they hadn't been touched since 1978, and they've well all the nuts have welded, and uh, he couldn't use his heat gun or his uh, torch because he would have set the fire alarms off. So he was banging all morning, and he didn't leave till about half two. Um, so um, that's why I couldn't make the video. But uh, yeah, so anyway, I was on Facebook and I noticed Renee had a load of stuff for sale and a couple of CDs I saw, one I'd never heard of and one I think I've heard of. And I said, we got talking and Renee said he'd send me some stuff, which I'm very appreciative, brother. Thank you very much. So without further ado, uh, let's see what we've got. And the first band is a band called Avassian. I hope I pronounced that right. And judging by the writing, it's Spanish. Um, that's all I know. New one on me, Renee. Have no idea. But that's the track listing, and uh, I liked it. It's a cover. It was one of these covers that looks really, really good. And I thought, well, I'd like to listen to that CD. And any metalhead that doesn't do that to me is a liar. Um, come on, be honest. You see a nice cover, and you think, ah, oh, that, that'll look good in the collection. Um, great. Let's see what else is there. Yeah, right. We've got another band. I've just got a message from Greg. Hello, Greg. Kane's Dynasty. Um, again, never heard of them. Um, anybody knows these bands? Can you put, looks a bit saucy. Yeah, but never heard of this one. But anybody has, comment below. But it's new to me. Thank you very much, Renee. Thank you very much. I'm honoured. Now, this is the band I have heard of. And uh, I'm hope hoping it's what I think it is. Um, I don't know. The only berserker I've heard is a band out of Melbourne, Australia. I'm hoping that's them. Um, I'm pretty sure it is. And I d they sort of went through a lot. I think they split up now. They they, they uh, split up in 2010. And, but they did have a phenomenally good drummer with them. Um, but this is the band I think it is. It's the Australian Berserker. The reason why you may think I'm a bit thick is because a lot of the, there's a big, big thing going at the moment. Um, I'm not naming the band. It's a famous Birmingham band. You can probably guess who it is. And there's a bit of trouble going about at the moment. Because apparently somebody's singing their songs. And they've got no permission to do so. And uh, the problem is it costs so much money to defend your copyright. Uh, if you reprint anything sort of they use for printing on the records. And they can do you. But there's no stopping you nicking their songs. And that's what's happening at the moment. And I've seen a couple of interviews. Um, so forgive me if I got it wrong but there's a lot of bands at the moment you may get to two or three different ones but unless that's a new start up band and they nick the name 
I'm pretty sure that's the band out of Melbourne, Australia. Uh, phenomenal band. It's sort of like death metal, bit of grunge, bit of industrial. And I'm looking forward to listening to that. Thank you very much, Renee. El Poda de la... No, I can't even pronounce that. Um, yeah, another Spanish um, CD. Looks like I might. Yeah, I hope it's Spanish. Um, can't pronounce any of that, but I might even go there and try. Uh, there's some more there for the Spanish-speaking folks. They'll probably put a comment below and say, um, "This is. I know what this is." But for us poor English folks uh, from Reading, not a chance. But I'm really, really made up, Renee. You didn't have to do this. And uh, Renee did tell me a couple were local bands. I hope I've got the Berserker right. And uh, I'm glad to actually own that because that's the only Berserker I can think of. And uh, it's abnormally warm here. It was going up to 20 degrees a couple of days ago. That's using like t shirts. Now they forecast snow on Monday. And by next Friday, we'll all catch the flu again because these temperatures keep going up and down, up and down. But uh, I hope everybody has a great weekend. And uh, again, thank you very much. Please check out, I mean, we all know Renee's channel, but if you haven't by chance know it, it's called Holspa, Holspa, it's in Spain, Renee. Um, but it's an absolutely fantastic channel. You learn a lot about, like, modern groups, everybody knows, like your Iron Maidens and... Um, you know, but uh, Renee's put me onto a lot of, lot of good music, and I mean, it is good. Uh, you would not normally heard of. You think, wow, well, I have to go investigate that band. Uh, but please check the channel out. Anyway, this is Steve. Uh, oh yeah, another thing I want to say. Um, the main, I might not be doing videos sort of once a week now because I've decided I'm having a rest from buying stuff. Um, it's getting ridiculous. Um, I, went, I didn't make mean to buy a lot last week, and you saw what I bought that last video. But uh, I want to do try and buy less. Say buy one or two CDs a month. Um, save up your money and do a really big record fair somewhere that's the, the uh, plan this year um, cause we've got a lot of other things going on at the moment and um, you know so I can't really afford to do the records but that's a, I've got loads here to listen to um, but do it that way so uh, hopefully I'll just do a what spinning uh, vid now once a week or something uh, but I hope I'm, tr I'm tr well you know what record collecting is like we all say this it, it, it's always hard but I'm trying not to buy stuff anymore but thanks again, Renee, and love folks, and have a great weekend.